from Connecticut, right? Yes, sir. Formerly the king of Connecticut once up, up until uh, Lincoln kind of took like a, a an elongated time off uh, near the end of Smash 4. Um, and has since come back with a vengeance uh, in uh, yeah. Ultimate. So yeah, he's been the he's been the kingdom before. It was a it was a couple might have been like a, a long time ago, like before that hiatus. He came here. And I think he won again. He won over Ridge and Grand. But anyway, to this set. Yeah, so we'll see how this works out here. Um, Peach is a character that is very, very strong in the early meta, albeit I feel like Peach is a strong character in almost like every Smash game, but the skill, the skill ceiling is so like weird for her that you only really see like the same like five or six people like putting in results with Peach. Wingling definitely one of them. Um, up until Light came around, like I said, he was like the guy you know, in charge in Connecticut. And right now, going up against Tokyo, uh, Lucas player, uh, formerly in Smash 4, now finds himself playing Ness uh, once again, even though he played a little bit of Ness in uh, Smash 4 also. Yeah, this is a PK kid, I mean, I Yeah, guess. man, loves Earthbound. He yeah. to say, that back air will get the job done. And Ling Ling, uh, off to the early uh, lead here. Yeah, right now, Tokyo really hasn't found any momentum, but he just needs to shake off the first stock. Like, all right, you know, like, I died super early, didn't really get to do much. But, you know, I gotta shake it off and just move on. Yeah, that's the thing about Peach, man. Like, if you're not paying attention, or, you know, if you're, like I said, DIing a combo the wrong way, you're gonna get blown up for a butt ton of damage. Because she still has, like, you know, great confirms both out of float and out of throws. Oh my goodness! Oh no. Don't do it to him. What? Wait, wait, where'd uh -huh. it go? Wait, where'd it go? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was so scary. <laughs> All right, PK Thunder is going to provide some coverage, and Ling Ling needed to get out of disadvantage. Yeah, that, that PK Thunder has always been a, a very good uh, juggling tool in Smash 4, and it just continues to be a good juggling tool, oh, yeah. despite the air dodge changes. Yeah, they, especially, uh, I feel like because air dodges are a lot more committal, you can't just like get down for free now. Like You actually have to respect PK Thunder as like uh, a landing. Oh, bonus. that was super close. Tokyo almost got him with the PK Thunder, too. I'm very surprised. Peach's dash attack is very strong. I'm surprised with the amount of rage that Ling Ling had on him that did not end up killing, but... Back throw finds wow. its mark, and Peach just disintegrates into the blast zone because that move is strong. <laughs> <laughs> but Ling Ling uh, has himself in such a good position right now that uh, Tokyo is going to have to work way harder um, yeah. to I get the stock off. I can already tell the pace of the match kind of slowed down. Like, couldn't be getting Tok uh, Ling Ling came out swinging, and now they're both like trying to feeling each other out a bit more. But, like Tokyo found more of its footing now. Yeah, there we go. Float backer gets the job done, and I believe. Uh, it's, that's kind of like the, the broken thing about Peach is that when she floats, uh, her moves don't get uh, counted into the short hop penalty. For, yeah. Uh, which is busted. <laughs> yeah, like her damage output is actually just insane. OD, because as of the that. kids would say nowadays. Well, I'm a kid and I don't even say OD. Maybe I'm no longer a kid then. <laughs> no, definitely not. I'm too but old to be here. <laughs> <laughs> I love this use of back air uh, coming up from Ling Ling. Just kind of like... Uh, you're kiting over whatever hitboxes Tokyo's throwing out. Like, Backer just does everything for Peach, man. Like, it, it, it's good damage, it kills. Uh, speaking of Backer for Ness, that comes through, so. Yeah. At least Tokyo's got us up within, like, uh, you know, spitting distance here. Uh, oh, that was good. But Peach's yeah. neutral air, uh, that moved kind of good. Peach nice, man. Yeah, she's nice. nice. Better than Daisy, am I right? Uh, am I right? Jury's out on that. Uh, I guess your mom doesn't hug you. No, absolutely not. <laughs> Look, man, I dress up as Peach. Shout out to Koo Peach. That was, a, <laughs> that was, that was a, a dark time of my life, but I had to. Did I tell you I had to cut that dress off of me when I put it on? Yeah, I, I think you mentioned that before. Yeah, that was a. That costume was a size too small, and your boy could not get out of it. <laughs> so, still up the crown, though. Crown nice. Oh, we're seeing the switch from Lucas. All right, I feel like that might be a bit better because PK Fire and Zare, like, might have sort of keep Peach on the ground. Yeah, in a sense. Um, or like, at least he's gonna give himself a better chance in the mid range game here. Yeah. I feel like that's where he's kind of getting like blown up right now. Yeah, I, I agree with the switch. Like, Ling Ling's just doing a good job, just kind of like floating around the hitboxes of what Ness was throwing out. At least with Lucas, he has like the added benefit of like PK Fire and, and Zare, like yeah. you said, to be able to kind of like fight through in the mid range better. Yeah, having being able to like sort of snipe Peach out of the air during like when she's just floating above the ground like that, having a good tool for that is always good in this matchup. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And FT is going to be an interesting choice here as well. There's going to be nowhere for either of these players to hide. And I feel yeah. like Peach, her, you know, I think one of her fewer struggles is that if you can keep her in disadvantage, um, she's definitely not as great as a character. Like I said, landing options are just not as good with the air dodge changes. Yeah. We'll see how it works out here. 
Yeah, this is. I feel like this counter pick was really calculated by Tokyo. He picked the right stage and made a right character switch. Yeah, but still finds himself into disadvantage here. So, ooh, almost getting the uh, the hit with the turn up right there, but uh, Tokyo able to get the PK rocket out in time. Again, like I said, a lot of just kiting around right now. Good forward air there from Ling Ling. Meets its mark. But Tokyo finds himself in a much better position than he did in the last game. Oh, God, um, the PK freeze. Dude, why does PK freeze send you that it's way? It's so good. I mean, we'll probably see in this set. But, like, you just get sent flying sideways. Who thought that was a good idea? What college intern do I need to <laughs> yell at who, like, programmed that move to send uh, you that way? Definitely wasn't me. What? Huh? <laughs> All right. Oh, almost getting that PK free. Oh, yeah. but he gets the F tilt to catch the normal getup. Yeah. So stuff from Tokyo. Yeah, like I said, Tokyo finds himself in much better. Oh, again the bomb! Oh lord. Oh, my. <laughs> Dude, I don't know. I feel like Peach Mains are just blessed with like great RNG in this game. They should all be speedrunners. Oh! oh my goodness! Oh, my that would have been that would have been amazing. Great stuff from Lingling going out there. Yeah, man, Lingling's a crazy. Lingling's a crazy person. Like. That's just, that was just so scary. And look at just how much damage he was able to get off of that. What the heck was uh, that? Oh, no, he's fine. Yeah, wow. Lucas still has one of like the best recoveries in the game, without a doubt. There we go. Ooh, Drop yeah. zone neutral air connects. Yeah, at that distance, I feel like he, he had two options. Either Zare or like, air dodge the stage. So <laughs> pray, it, pray to God. Yeah, I guess that's the third option. <laughs> I mean, we are in a church, so it might have worked. <laughs> yeah, so Lingling kind of stuck in the corner right now, but able to break zone once again. Again, neutral air and a shield proving to be such a strong tool. He just neutral air low-key kind of stupid. Like, that move does a lot of damage if you, like, aren't... Like, what you actually, like, read, like, in comparison to other, like, neutral airs. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, PK Spire is going to meet its mark, so Tokyo continuing to press right now. Cool. Okay. Like, I feel like Tokyo's doing a really good job of, like, just sort of keeping the pressure and being unable to, like, let Ling Ling find an opportunity oh! to kill him. But that turn-up snipe, it's going to be it. Eat your vegetables, says the princess. Yeah. And Ling Ling moving on into winner's quarters. I believe he is uh, on pace to uh, meet Odyssey, actually. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Look at that happy face on the turn-up. Dude, the Earthbound characters look, like, so distressed when they're in, like, <laughs> it's so like, funny. When the I love it. On them.